Good morning. All right, so before we go into all of that, Coach, how are you? I'm fine. Thank you very much. I'm fine. I'm preparing my comeback to Nigeria because uh, I will come very soon now to prepare our game, World Cup qualifiers. And also, uh, we are finishing our list. You know, it's not easy to do a list, especially in uh, pandemic uh, time. We have a big problem with our players from UK because uh, coming back from Cap Verde, which is a red zone for UK, we have to do quarantine. And the clubs now are telling us we cannot give you the players because when they come back to UK, we cannot use them for 10 days. They have to go to quarantine. So we are fighting actually with FIFA and with English uh, Football uh, Association to have the players. So it's a, a very big problem. We are in this stress actually to fight to have. We have eight players from our list actually who are playing in UK, in England or in Scotland. So uh, it's not easy uh, to do our job in the moment. Okay, so coach, uh, you talk about this list. I really don't even know what the list is. Uh, before I let Emmanuel ask you a question, uh, Coach, can we get an idea of what is on your list? Of course, uh, we did already a provisional list of 31 players and uh, now we will reduce to 23. The problem is what I'm telling you that uh, we are not sure to have our English players or, or Scottish players for the second game because the first game it's okay we will have uh, Liberia in Lagos. They can come back to England without quarantine. For the second game, it's a big problem. So I have to do another list for the second game. This is why actually we are discussing uh, today, yesterday, this morning, again this afternoon with the president, with the team manager and with my assistant, Mr. Tunde, which is in, in England actually to have our players you know so we will have a list of uh, 23 like always but actually on the 23 we have eight players from uk which are not sure to be there to go to cap verde that's why i cannot give the list uh, already now this is a big problem we are fighting for them we are speaking with them we are speaking with the UK federations, Scottish and English. We are speaking with FIFA. We are speaking with UEFA. The same situation was already for European Championship this year. But there was an exception for these players. No quarantine for the players who had to go to countries for the English or British players coming back, no quarantine. There was an exception. We want to have the same thing. We want it to be treated the same way. They are professionals. They are not playing in European teams. That's true. But they are playing in Africa. There is no reason that they don't have the same rights like the other one. And then uh, when we will have the, the, the best team, the number one team, it is changing all the time. It's depending what they are doing in the clubs. If they are doing very well in the clubs, they will play with us. If they are not good in the clubs, I cannot take them. So it's all the time a little bit different. We have to adapt what's happening in the clubs and to the actual fitness of our players. You are listening to Elegbete TV Radio.